The Creating Champions Youth Expo is coming up Saturday, August 7th at First Presbyterian Church in Clinton. And I'd like to welcome our guest from Impact to Purpose to talk to us about this, Rhonda Gary. She's the founder, Valerie Gaines, a board member, also mentor, Shaquille Harp. Welcome, everybody. Thank you for having us. Now, before we get into all of the particulars of this event, I want to talk about Impact to Purpose. This is a powerful organization for our youth, um, your mission and your purpose. Hello, my name is Rhonda Gary and I'm the founder and um, director of Impact of Purpose here in Lawrence County. Um, a little bit about ourselves. The mission is to strengthen the lives of youth and families in our community by co um, connecting uh, a, a network of mentors to enhance, inspire and empower and also educate, which are the tools necessary for youth to be successful. And so um, we have put together this awesome event. Uh, it, we're excited um, and we hope the community is excited along with us. And this event, the purpose of this event is not only to teach, not only to teach our youth to be their own boss, but to seize the moment, to mm. seize the moment to follow their dreams. Um, this event will also be a chance for young entrepreneurs, junior CEOs to put on public display their um, genius creativity while um, the community come aboard and, and, and support them and see what we're doing. These are going to be our next potential business owners here in the county. How can people become a member or join this organization to help you out? So we're always looking for um, great mentors, number one. We're always looking for great mentors. Um, they can stop by, um, go on our website. Um, we will share the website at the end. You know, um, it is a little process. You have to do a training as far as um, becoming a mentor here Um with impact the purpose, um, background check, um, a little screening, but it is for a good cause. <laughs> it, and all we ask is two hours a month, 30 minutes a week, if they can, um, to spend with as a trusted friend to youth here in the community. Now, our, our, our youth is a little bit different. We always have get referrals in from the school district. The school district, family members, they may stop by. They have looked us up on Facebook and, you know, same to his kind of process, but we never turn any children away. We never turn children away. So um, that's a good thing. Okay. And I want to ask Shaquille, uh, being a mentor, tell me a little bit about um, your mentorship and, and um, how you got involved. Yes, ma'am. So um, Rhonda actually stopped me in Walmart and I guess you could tell just by speaking to me that I could bring something good to the table. And so back then we was doing a workshop out of the library before we got our building. And so I went to the workshop and I was like, I got the join, I got the join. <laughs> yeah. And so um, being a mentor from a male perspective, I try and help them to be a leader and not a follower because a lot of kids they like to see what one person do and think oh I'm gonna do this but it don't go the way they expect it to go. Can you tell us um, just thinking of some of the children that you have mentored or some, some of the youth I correct myself there some of the youth that you have mentored can you think of a, a time where you've seen progress and change and that light bulb going off in that student yes ma'am um i could probably think of plenty of them <laughs> um some of them we had uh, they was doing really bad at school and like they would get bad reports almost every day and so we try and teach them from the mentor side that if you do really well at school we're we'll treat you with an incentive and that incentive has encouraged them over the years to do any even better at home as well as at school. So the Creating Champions Youth Expo is coming up on Saturday, August 7th at First Presbyterian Church from 10 till 4. Valerie Gaines, let's bring you in. You're a board member, and I know you're always very excited to talk about some of the events for Impact to Purpose. So tell us about what is going to be going on that day. This event is a combination. 
of bringing our young entrepreneurs together from the ages of five, serious minded, from the ages of five to 18, um, to bring in their, their wares, their, their talents that they have uh, been working on, that they've been honing in on, and they want to become the next shark or the next um, CEO and make a, a, make a big impact. Uh, on the world. So we are looking for those children, those youth to come out and be a part of this. Um, Rhonda and I, we hail from Oconee County and we live yeah. down here in Lawrence County. So we don't only want to reach out to those that are here in Lawrence, but we want to spread the love and give all youth that are seriously minded a chance to come out and be a part of this a youth expo. Come get this knowledge. You don't care where you're from, Newberry, Columbia, Charleston, Greenville, Seneca, no matter where you're from, come and be a part, bring your family, come and be a part of this. Um, we're wanting to make an impact for this purpose, right? Yeah, yeah. So we wanna, um, we wanna make sure we reach the masses for this. Um, what else is it gonna involve? It's gonna involve having speakers from the community, from different organizations, such as law enforcement, such as um, the uh, um, EMS, such as from, um, from the National Guard unit, from, from individuals that have started out maybe in a trouble with a troubled childhood, but now they are growing. They are, have gotten more contracts. So you just never know. You can always small, start small, but it's all in who pours into you and what they pour yes. into you is mm -hmm. how much you grow. So we want, we want to make sure that we are feeding and, and imparting into our youth. You can do anything you want to do. We exactly. just have to have the foundation and the support to give to you. And that's what we're looking forward to doing for this event. What else are we going to have? We're going to have speakers from the Divine Nine, which are some of the Deltas, some of uh, soror sororities and fraternities that are going to be there that's going to impart. We want to impart knowledge, impact, impart, educate, strengthen. That's the basis for this for this creating a champion um, youth expo. We want to pour into them. What else are we going to have? A step show. We're going to have a step show by um, one of the local step teams and give them the opportunity, young step teams, give them an opportunity to show forth their talent and put them out there on stage and push them forward. Um, we're going to have our MC is going to be my friend Rico Booker, from Upstate Fatherhood Coalition. Um, yes. a great program, a great men touring program that brings fathers and their children together. So what greater um, MC can you have than one that's already a mentor? He works with the baseball team. He's the AAU of the baseball team. He does basketball. So, you know, he's always working with the youth. And we're going to feed. We want to feed our uh, the people that come. We want to... Uh, we're giving out um, backpacks and back to school because we know we have our children that's going back to school, our youth going back to school, whether they're going to college or whether they're going back to grade school, just advancing as they go. So we want to impart into them, feed them not just physically, but let's feed them mentally, emotionally, and create a, a champion that will pay it forward, bring it back home, and let's do that thing again. Exactly. I have to tell you that this is a brilliant idea because, you know, it's uh, uh, vendors for youth and just about they can shop for just about anything with knowledge based organizations there to help them out. I, I applaud you. I applaud you. Once again, the Creating Champions Youth Expo set for August 7th at First Presbyterian Church in Clinton from 10 till 4. And before we go, if anyone would like to get any more information about Impact to Purpose or would maybe like to uh, join your organization or donate or volunteer, give us that information, please. So ways they can get involved, um, they can make us a check, of course, payable to impact the purpose. Um, 
P.O. Box 1632, Lawrence, South Carolina, 29360. Um, cash app, I cash app is hooked directly to our bank. It seems to be the quickest way. And our cash app is dollar sign impact to purpose one. And of course, the most important thing, uh, monetary is good, but donations, I mean, donations of time, volunteer is always the best. Um, we cannot express how much we need that support from our community coming in. August the 1st, we'll launch our campaign, 100 mentors in 100 days. So we are going to be scavenging, looking for some great mentors. So as I said, monetary is good, but time is always of value. For more information on our um, program, you can look us up on Facebook um, at Impact to Purpose on Facebook and also I2P Mentoring. All right. I do appreciate you guys coming on the show today and much success with your Creating Champions Youth Expo. Thank, Thank you, you Thank so you. much. Y'all come be with us. Exactly. <laughs> come, come. Thank you so much. <laughs>